in this scenario, I got a call from a guy who's renting out his house, and his, I guess his tenant's got no AC on the second floor, so I just talked to the tenant. He says the handyman was over there, and he says the outside unit's not, fan's not spinning outside, so I'd do it. Oh, man, I'd do it, Miss Molly. I'd do it, Miss Molly. Yeah. The fan's not spinning outside. I'd do it. Oh, man, I don't know. We'll have to go over there and check it out. Flipping hot as hell out here today. Holy shit. I don't know. He says the, he says the, um, the fan up in the attic, the, the filter up in the attic, he don't know if that's been changed or not. We'll be able to tell when we get it up and running if it's um, if there's a problem with the filter. Low suction, you know, type of thing. Flipping hot out here today. Holy shit, like 85. Yeehaw! Might not be hot for you southern dudes, but up here, that's hot for me. I like it around 70, my Molly. I like the temperature around 70. Yeah, yeah, you do. I know you do. You like it cool. Yeah, yeah, I know you love it cool. Yeah, you like it cool, Miss Molly. Anyway, we'll try to get you some shots when I get there. See what's going on with this unit. We'll go check the outside unit for a thing. Okay. Steve is working again, y'all. Steve is working again, Mama. You got, it, you got it off inside, right? No, it's on. Didn't the guy call you and tell you to shut it off? No. Go, go, go in the house and shut off the a AC. You got it. And I'll check it out here, okay? Tell the guy to shut it off. I think he listens? Don't sound like it. Tell, tell the homeowner. I'll call the tenant and tell him to shut it off. Okay, I'm going to do it. That was two hours ago. Didn't even shut it off. Typical bullshit, you know. Flipping. Yeah, I hear it, yeah. Okay. Pass it. Oh, everything looks good. Let's see if this thing starts. Might have tripped the breaker. Let's see, see if we got any power. Eighty-six volts. That's not good. That's not good. Thought we had a problem with the power going outside. Something screwed up. I'm only getting one pound on one leg, so we might have a bad breaker here or something. It's not pulled in, so let's check this. Uh, these 15 amp I'm not sure which one it is but one of them's not giving us full power out there we're not getting 220 we're getting 110 so that's an issue Let's see if we could find out why There's our one right there. We've got a bad breaker there. It's only got 87 volts. Oh, that's 207. That one should be okay. Two forty there. Two forty there. Here's our breaker pad, we got 80, 80, 
86. A bad break, it looks like. I should have another one of them in the truck. Alright, for some reason, we're, we're only getting 86 here on this one. It's kind of a weird I'm gonna just change that breaker. And it just clips in like that, see it? She looks a little cooked. See it? That's our problem. She looks a little arced. I could put a new breaker in there, but I don't know. That's not looking so good. another breaker in there and this one's tighter right I don't know how long it's gonna last the other one was a lot tighter he's gonna need a new panel but that might get him by for now we'll see I mean I don't know how long it's gonna last you're gonna need to get an electrician out here and change this panel <sighs> alright we're getting 240 now Okay. 